hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel and today i'm gonna take you to the most exciting part of our thailand trip this is one of my childhood dream and the major part of my bucket list we woke up around 6 30 a.m and we started traveling at around 7 30 a.m from bangkok to pataya it took us almost two hours traveling there we are so excited to meet the gentle giants and the national animal of thailand we book a reservation via clue we paid 4220 pesos or 1055 each we only booked half day or the feeding program because we thought that bathing with the elephants is included on the package but it is included in the 3000 plus pesos which is a whole day package i highly suggest to rent a car going there because it will take you like 5 to 10 minutes going inside to the feeding program camp one it has always been my dream to get up close and personal with elephants and at this point i cannot believe that i will be able to see them and spend time with them <laughs> Seven elephant is of them have their own name. Mm. Mm. Okay, and what we gonna do? We feed them, make mm. friends. Okay. No food, no friends. <laughs> like people, no money, no honey. <laughs> okay, what we have here? Pineapple and banana. Very simple way. Hold this way. Do not go flat hand because the elephant hand very big. Okay, hold this way and feed by the trunk. <coughs> okay, and hold this way, feed by the trunk. Don't play with their food like this, okay? Uh -huh. okay? And we have this one, her name is Ninja. Ninja? Yeah. Middle one, her name is Somo. 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 And that one, her name is Wasana. Wasana. Ah, okay. Over there, over there, over there. The oldest one here. Oldest? Her name is Vanessa. Vanessa? Yeah. <laughs> and we have other two over there. Later on, we'll take you there. Okay. okay. So, how we feed them, you can just banana and pineapple by the trunk. If you're ready, you can start there. Okay. Let's go. Okay. They got the food there. Okay? You can okay. follow the man. Okay. Who's the one that is not really friendly? Uh, one of the... Actually, most of them friendly. Mm. But mm. once in a while, try not to touch too much. Ah, uh, she's not really... She's not... It doesn't mean that she's aggressive. Because... She's the she's... one with the... With the... Cut Tail, right? Yeah, right. Yeah. Oh, you've been here? No, I, I searched in the YouTube. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, because mm. she is learning how to be with people. Oh. But she's she's now... from a circus or what? She, she's from a circus or oh, she's, she's, she's work. She yeah, she worked. has been working before. Oh, I yeah. see. Okay, okay, you can feed Ninja first. All right. Okay, you can stop. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Ma, you just video us. Yes, okay. yes, yes, yes.
Actually, this one is her daughter. It's just like when you have the dog, when it's out of control, the man also go crazy for some time. But he, but they, they all can see, right? They all can see, yeah. Ah, when is that? Sometimes she doesn't listen to him. Yeah, you can feed her. But she's she's no she's she's oh uh, she's the oldest one. Yeah. Um. Oldest one. Um. 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 Hey, video. At this time, we will going to meet the young or the baby elephants. It will took them a lot of years to produce a baby elephant. All of the elephants in this sanctuary is female, except for the two baby elephants. They will be needing to have a male one. They will gonna borrow a male elephant from other sanctuaries here in Thailand. However, they will be needing a lot of finances to support the needs of the elephants. That's why I highly suggest to include this one in your itinerary if you have extra money so that we can help them from being extinct. Okay, uh, okay everyone. So, as I said before, seven, seven elephants. Mm -hmm. Not all the elephants we rescue. Mm. Like only Wasana, no, stealing the food. <laughs> <laughs> only Wasana, we rescue her. Mm. And the rest of them, like Vanessa or like the other, they come with their owner. Mm. The man who takes care of them is their owner. Mm -hmm. Because the man, they live in the village and they cannot offer us like for food, yeah. mm. for medical support. So they bring elephants here. Mm. And so we are just helping them, okay, right. to have a better life. <laughs> Yeah, that's why the number of the elephant is not uh, stable. Sometimes high, sometimes low. Because when the elephant are ready and the men are ready to go back, they will take the elephant home. Yeah. So you can fit her. This one, one D. Okay, one D is ten years old. Ten years old. Mm. Wow. This one, Ban Yen. They are best friend. 
Muna siya sama Jung ma. 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 Muna Yeah, uh, this is their natural behavior. Okay. Keep more food, keep more food. No. <laughs> Some of the elephants, they don't like pineapple. Ah. Ah. She doesn't like pineapple. You will see female elephants, they don't have the tusks. Okay. They all hear female. Oh, they all hear female. Uh, That's why it's complicated. <laughs> uh, females are complicated. <laughs> no. <laughs> How do we know they are full? How do we know they are full? I never see they are full eating. Like, um, like, um, how many like kilos or yeah, they're they're. Elephant they eat uh ten percent of their body weight. Ah, this one, she how weight is four ton. Four thousand kilogram. She eat. She eat four hundred kilogram a day. Yeah, that is one of the reason that the men who can't afford the food for them, so they bring elephant here. By government. This is government or no? Private. Private. The government do nothing. No. We can't depend on the guy. We are depend on you. They don't like pineapple. They don't like pineapple. They don't like pineapple. Here, oh, the baby one. Do you wanna take a group photo? Yeah. Yeah. How about this one? You wanna take a group photo? Okay. Aw man, to sa lashes, adiba? Ang lashes. They eat uh, the fiber, fiber, not banana. They eat like the grass, the tree, bamboo. Yeah, the, the, yeah. Because normally, normally the people also make by the tree, right? Yeah. But this one thirty percent of elephant food. The guide was explaining how they make the paper from an elephant poop. It was explained that it's only 30% of the elephant poop and it is not dirty because the food of the elephants are all fiber, produced fruits and vegetables. So every day they collect the elephant poop and they will put it on a screen. And they made a um, water pool which has 5 to 10 inches water. And then they will gonna put the elephant poop inside the screen which is also a molder. For the paper so you need to scatter the elephant poop and then right after if the elephant poop is already scattered evenly you need to take out the screen and then make it dry under the sun This strip won't be complete if I will not gonna try this. I promise you that it's not dirty. The elephant poop looks like a cotton. The pillow or the bed. Foam.
The guide also showed us the finished product or the dried ones. So this is the final result of the paper. It was really nice and it doesn't smell bad at all. My mom asked the guide she can have the sample. We were all laughing because the guide said that if you miss the elephant, you just need to check the paper or smell it. But I tell you, it doesn't smell bad at all. I'm so happy to see that the elephants are really free to roam around. They are just doing what they love to do which is eating a lot. It is like they're living in their own habitat with of course the guidance of the people around them. It's really heartwarming when you see them not carrying heavy loads. That's why I discourage you to ride on them. Excuse me. Excuse me. Can I do that? Yeah. Wow. Did you die? Come on, honey. Pasirit pa layo. Dalong ganda pit. Giginahan kayo siya. Ugwan mo. Likod na po dahil likod. Po na gibiyaan na ta. Okay. This is really one of the highlights of our trip. My heart was really full and fulfilled. My dream of being connected to the nature. What a magical feeling. I will certainly go back again with the whole day package. We have learned a lot about elephants. Saving them is not yet too late. This forever holds a place in my heart. Thank you so much for watching and see you on my next video. Bye-bye.